Hi there, I'm uh, Troy Komodo. I'm a survey biologist for the Canadian Food Inspection Agency and we're at Mountain View Cemetery in uh, Vancouver, British Columbia. Hemlock woolly adelgid is an aphid-like insect that sticks its beak into the tissue of hemlock needles. They suck the juices out of it. Here in British Columbia, hemlock woolly adelgid is not a pest, but in Eastern Canada, it was introduced from Japan. There and Eastern USA, it's actually killing uh, large mature hemlock trees. Hemlock woolly adelgid creates these white woolly wax tough balls and these little balls only occur at the base of, of a hemlock needle. Sometimes you might get white feces that are on the middle part of the needle or at the tip. That's not hemlock woolly adelgid because it only occurs just at the base of the needles. The interesting thing about this system is that they're all females. And when the female lays eggs, which was about two, three weeks ago, the eggs will hatch in about 10 to 14 days and a tiny little crawler will emerge. The purpose of the uh, trapping experiment uh, with the yellow traps behind me is we want to come up with a system that we can detect if we go anywhere in British Columbia, or Washington, Washington State or Oregon. As soon as we get into a new city and we find hemlocks, we want to place these traps into those trees to find out if the predator's there. It's a lot quicker than for us to actually take down the branches, clip them, and then put the branches under a microscope and look for signs of the fly. It's a lot easier if we just put up a trap. Here in British Columbia, HWA, hemlock woolly adelgid, is, is not a pest, but uh, out in eastern Canada, eastern USA, this adelgid is a major pest of eastern and Carolinian hemlocks, where it does cause tree mortality all across the landscape. And what we're trying to do is use these flies as biological control out in eastern Canada.